Hi guys, hope you're well today. Today's video I am doing a Disneyland Paris haul. Now if you're watching my vlogs at the minute you'll know that I have been to Disneyland Paris recently. I went February the 20th to the 23rd with my friend Matt for his birthday and we had an awesome time. I took a lot of money and bought a few things but I still came back with 150 euros so yay for me. And I thought I would show you some of the things I've been buying. Now the first thing I had to spend my money on was a renewal for my annual pass because mine got stolen. Um, long story, you can, you'll can you have seen it if you've watched day two if this goes up after day two. Um, but yeah, it's kind of... That was not fun, so that was 25 euros. Now, the merchandise I will now move on to. So whilst I was in Disneyland Paris, they started putting out all the 25th merchandise into all of the shops. And I resisted for most of the um, few days I was there. But then on my last night, I was like, do you know what? I really need to get some ears because they're so cute. And they had a gold and black pair, which seemed like a more mature person's choice rather than a child's but I ended up getting these they're really cute they're black with stars on purple very starry very 25th um, I really like them and these cost me they would normally cost 16 euros 99 but with the annual pass discount that I got I got them for 13 euros 59 and I've not actually tried them on yet so uh Tell you what, we'll do the video with me wearing my ear, 25th ears because they are adorable. One of the final things I bought from the trip, I'm kind of not doing it in an order, um, was this. It's a Duffy, but he's a backpack. He's got a cute little zip down his tummy and I saw it and I had to have it. I didn't see it in the storybook shop on Main Street where all the Duffy stuff used to be. There's actually hardly any Duffy stuff in there now. But I was like, yay, I could have a Duffy backpack and it could just be something cute, you know, to use every now and again. I don't know when, but I'm sure I will use it. And without the annual pass discount, it's 30 euros. But with the annual pass discount, I got it for 23 euros 99. So I saved myself about 6 euros, really, which I thought was pretty awesome. So... There's Duffy and the straps as well. The straps are like Velcro, so even because I'm an adult, I can make this fit around my back and shoulders. So, yay, he's just too cute. Now, something I bought for my friend um, to thank her for picking me up from the train station very late at night when I got back on Thursday was these two Minnie Mouse pens. She had asked me to see if they were still around and I just thought, I'll get them and then I don't have to pay her a fiver for taxi, um, for being a taxi for me. <laughs> and these costs, now these pens cost €5.99 each so they're quite expensive for pens i did get my annual pass discount but i can't quite remember what it was so i know she's gonna love these and she will write her way through many notebooks and diaries with them so yeah i hope she likes these and i can show them because she won't see this video i went into the main street emporium as well and i bought a couple of things in there the first thing i bought was the Beauty and the Beast booster pack. It's only recently come out. It costs €18.99 and that was without the annual pass discount. I got it, actually don't know what I got it because I got it with a load of things. Um, so there was this, these pins. I also got Mrs. Potts and Chip. Focus. Oh, there we go. It's focused there. So that's Mrs. Potts and Chip. I got Beauty and the Beast, like Belle and Beast dancing in their ball gown. Sorry, it's not focusing, guys. And then I bought one of the standard open edition pins, which is this nice Rapunzel pin, and she's very sparkly. There we go. She's very sparkly, very pretty. And I also got this postcard with Simba 
Timon and Pumba and it says best friends on it and I'm going to put this in my scrapbook um, and document like my trip because that's what I do. If you want to see my scrapbook at some point I'll show you. This would have cost one euro fifty but obviously I got the discount. Um, trying to decide which one out of me, Matt and Mitch who went on the trip is who. I think I'm Simba. I think Matt might be Timon. So that leaves Mitch with Pumba. Sorry Mitch. Now the total for all that with my AP discount was €43.55 so I consider that quite a good bargain really. Now I wanted something a little bit special this trip. I didn't want to go mad on pins even though you guys know I love my pins. There wasn't a lot in the shops that excited me and I thought I want to get something nice and something pretty and then maybe a little bit sparkly. So I went to the shop under the castle and I got a lovely little box here and I'll show you what's inside. I got this Mickey crystal necklace. It's got a little gem in the middle that sparkles and it's really pretty and yeah I really saw it and I liked it and the woman went behind the till to go look for it in the back and apparently this was the last one so I actually got it from the display cabinet itself. Um, I don't know why I wanted it, I just thought I could wear this most days maybe on future Disney trips and things or just wear it around whenever I feel like it and carry a bit of Disney with me. Now I believe the necklace was 44 euros, 44 something euros and I got it for 35 so nearly like 10 euros off which I thought was pretty awesome. Um, yeah. I really like it, I can't wait to wear it. Now the final thing that I bought for myself was, again, something from the 25th range actually. I didn't realise it until I've just looked at it now. Um, it's a photo album and I wasn't going to buy any 25th merch for myself purely because I thought this is my last trip. But then a miracle happened. I ended up sponsoring three annual passes um, while on my last full day and it looks like I could be going back to Disney for future um, 25th trips. I don't know how many or how it'll work but I'll try and organise something and I thought if I'm going for 25th I'll get a photo album and on my next trip or trips I'll take as many photos as possible and fill the photo album and this is one of the nicest ones they've got. It's from like the black and gold range that they have. They have another one which is more steampunky like the ears I've got on now but yeah this is from the slightly more adult range and it's really pretty. It's got sparkles and yeah the castle. It looks stunning. It's like in a copper gold kind of effect. It can hold 200 photos and it cost €34.99 at full price and with the discount, um, which actually wasn't my discount, it was my friend in the world of Disney Star, I got it for €26.24, so yay! I have a 25th album, I still haven't filled up the album I bought from my last trip actually, I need to start printing my photos off for that one. So that's all the things I bought for myself, but I have decided because I'm such a nice person and I want to spread some more pixie dust, I've decided to do another giveaway. Now this giveaway is going to be on Twitter so if you have Twitter you'll want to go in, along to my page and check it out. I'll put my name down below here and I'll try and leave a link in the description box as well. But yeah I thought I just want to be nice and spread some Disney magic. And so from now, when this video goes up, I am going to hold a giveaway for two weeks. And all you have to do to win is to like and retweet. So I'm going to be keeping a note of who's liking and retweeting. If you don't do those two things, you aren't going to be entered into the Twitter giveaway. And the prize is... Another pair of these wonderful ears, so you can win a pair of these like mine, and something else they were selling in the shop is these 
accessory photo props. So they're 25th anniversary style and you get Mickey's steampunk hat, Goofy's eyes I think, Chip's, no, Dale's like mouth, uh, Mickey's steampunk glove hand, some eye masks in shapes of stars, a happy anniversary sign, a star wand, a pair of mini ear props, a Goofy mouth and a Donald mouth. And yeah, how fun would this be, guys, if you're going to Disneyland Paris soon to win these and then be able to take photos of them around the park? I'm sorry about my phone going off all the time. I forgot to put it on silent. So, yeah, you could win these if you go along to my Twitter and enter the giveaway. So remember, you have to like and retweet. And if you want to follow me on Twitter as well as on here, that would be great. But, you know, I'm doing this out of the goodness of my heart, guys, honestly. So I really wish you all well, those who decide to enter. And that was my whole video, guys, and giveaway announcement. If you've liked this video, give it a thumbs up for me. Comment down below, subscribe, and I will see you next time, guys, for future Disney videos. Bye! Also, guys, can we just talk about something here? I'm sat in a mermaid tail blanket that my mum knitted for me. Isn't it cute? I feel like I need to sing an aerial song with this on somewhere cool, so...